I will continue the presentation with the second main point, which is individual role as engineer. As you can see, this is engineer at the factory. Next. The individual role of engineer is to follow the ethics in the working place like the other workers. This is because engineer is a leader in some factories. So, a leader needs to show a good attitude to other technicians. Which follow the rule, the technician also can gain respect, can respect the engineer because the engineer is a good engineer because they follow the rule. Next, which follow the ethic, we can also protect ourselves from becoming danger. This is because at the factory, safety actually is a number one because safety comes first and the others come later. The next is alert to its environment and well known the precaution step and safety procedure. This is because if we alert with an environment, we can give immediate action. For example, our technicians have injured because of some saw blade or fall uh, heavy things. So if we alert with environment, we can know where is the fire extinguisher, where is the first aid. So we can give the immediate action to the Next is, we also need to know the safety procedure which is when there are some fire occur and what's next to do so if we know the procedure, everything can move smoothly with alert with environment, we can also prevent the injuries become fatal because we give uh, early treatment so we also can detect danger at early stage for example, we have know all our environment and some things and some day we feel that a machine vibrate more vigorously or the sound is more rough so we can check the machines and we know oh this machine have a loose screw so we tie it and we can prevent from become accident next the next point is the maintenance and promotion of focus health and working capacity. As you can see, this is a technician and they are control some machines. So, how to maintain and promote workers' health and working capacity, which remind technicians about safety in the working place? We need to remind every time to the technician about the safety. The basic things of the safety is a helmet and the safety boots. At the site, actually, they are a safe place because there are some safety level that safety. So, dangerous is occur only if you are careless. So, because at the factory or the sites, there are some sharp thing for a saw blade, there are explosive material, there are some heavy material that's hanging over our head. So a small mistake can cause danger and can make an accident or maybe can even cause death. Next is to make sure all the machine in the best conditions. How? This we know the last time of the machines. So if we know the life span of the mission, we know the limit and when we need to service the missions. So sometimes the mission can reach the limit earlier because they are something because they are used every day every day. So if we know the life span, so we can estimate when we need to check or we need to change the spare part. So we also know the broken system of the machines. So, next question. Okay, uh, for the next point is improvement of working 
environment and work to become conducive to safety and health. Okay. The point is to create a plan to promote workplace health and safety. Okay, as role, uh, we as a role of uh, uh, <laughs> what the fuck?